All right, folks, welcome back to the channel. Jimmy Kiwi here. It's been a while since a video, but the reason I'm making this video is because I see a lot of talk on the internet about turn signal troubles. What we have here is a 2009 GMC Sierra SLE. Symptoms I was having was my, of course, my flasher started. When I put my left turn signal on, flasher started flashing like crazy. Problem there. So first thing I did was change the bulbs, and that seemed to fix the problem briefly. Then a day or two later, I, it's doing the same thing again. <clears throat> and uh, I get in there thinking, must be corrosion issue. So I'm fiddling with the sockets, doing what I can. Seem to fix it again, briefly. So going through, end up pulling the dash apart. A little bit of it anyway. I don't know if you can see it here very well. Probably not. Um, trying to find a flasher unit, test that. I can't seem to find one. I'm all over the internet looking for one and finding the same problems with people. Well, it, it it come on and then it would immediately start flashing real quick. And uh, anyway, just driving me nuts and people want to give me part numbers, whatever. Either way, this is what I ended up discovering. Underneath the back of this truck, down low, tracing these wires down, there is a place right here you want to pull those off and check for corrosion. As you can see, it's right by the spare tire. Here's the back bumper getting underneath. Spare tire. Where do those things plug in? I had a fair amount of corrosion. I've cleaned it all up. And first thing I was, you know, check the four ways, check everything. And suddenly, everything's working fine again so that's the place to look under the bumper left side driver's side whatever you call it corrosion happening there save yourself five hundred dollars from the dealership for a day of whatever they're gonna do and parts they're gonna change out this is jimmy kiwi signing off hope that was helpful somewhere on this game